Go. Good morning, everybody. I'm going to talk about inflation. I do feel it's important to discuss this on a video because there are a couple of misconceptions that we need to straighten out right at the beginning. Firstly, what is inflation? Well, my husband loves to tell me that uh, back in the 80s, he could buy me um, a plate of chips and a milkshake for about 50 cents. You certainly couldn't do that today, and that is because of inflation. So inflation is the general increase in the price of goods, which leads to the decreased buying power of our money. So please know that definition. The inflation rate is determined by Statistics South Africa. So they look at the increase in price over a period of time. It could be even just one month looking at the change in price from the beginning of the month to the beginning of the next month. But more often our um, inflation rate is quoted per year. So they'll look in the, at the increase in price, say from January 2019 to January to 2020, over the original price in January 2019 and times 500. So actually that is the percentage increase. So here it is, an inflation rate of 5, um, sorry, this should be 5,17%. So far for 2020, well, we're not very far into 2020. So this would say be from January 2019 to January 2020. There is a 5,17% increase in the price of goods. Statistics South Africa is the entity that generates our inflation rate. And they look at about 2,500 different items. This is known as the Consumer Price Index or CPI. In this basket of goods and services, it is not a literal basket, but an imaginary basket that would include items like food, like fuel, uh, and various other ser uh, services. It could be accommodation in a hotel room as part of this basket of goods and services. I now need time to clean the board. So please uh, use this moment to take a photograph and copy this into your notes while I clean the board. Thank you.